chug, 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 chug. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Thirsty Thursday edition of the Dumb Marsh Podcast Drink of the Week, sponsored by Brewthrough Beer Distributor and more in Braddock Hills slash Pittsburgh, PA. Head on over there. Tell them your boys, the Dumb Marsh Podcast sent you to get you all right with their plethora of drink choices and today we're reviewing something that they promoted on their social media recently here jason what do we have in store today today we have uh the beast unleashed it's uh monsters hard hard uh whatever you call it hard energy drink so my opinion of this coming into where I was going to say this is the worst drink we've ever done. Maybe behind the protein beer that we drank, because that was absolutely horrible, Donald. I'm still mad about this. However, my position has changed, and I've become slightly optimistic about this, because if you read the back of the can here, um, Monster itself turned 21, so they decided to make this hard drink for people to enjoy. They removed... They removed the energy blend, cut out the caffeine and the sugars. So this is not no. an alcoholic energy drink. Okay. This is their just their own alcoholic drink, which gives me optimism because if I was drinking an alcoholic energy drink, I'm going to go after this show and segment and stare in the mirror and question my life. <laughs> so you're going to take the so are you going to take the nastiness of an energy drink and just make it alcoholic? We'll find out in a second, but yeah, so this is just this is just a regular alcoholic beverage. No energy drink blend, no caffeine, no, okay. no no cocaine, none of that other stuff that you find in energy drinks. Like it's just a pure alcoholic drink, allegedly. We'll see That's what they say. Yeah, it this smells is, like peach. I'll go on that. And this is peach perfect, of course, because Jason selected it. Everything peach all day, every day, all day. Six percent alcohol by volume. Uh, a big big can. Pause. Um, See if it delivers. Oh, Jason's Guys may like matter this. in this instance. We'll see. Definitely smells peachy. Jason, is this two thumbs up for you? I'm going to give it a two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very sweet. And that's yeah, it is. You liking that. But it does not taste like an energy drink. And that, no. that is very good. Honestly, it feels no different than some of their, like their uh, zero brand stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm, okay. Yeah, because I drank all their uh, zero, I mean, their zero cow stuff. It, it tastes just like that. If mm -hmm. there's no sugars in this, like, is, this can't be this sweet just off of pure peach. Like, what are they, like, if, they, the if, this, is. This, if this, if it is this sweet just off of pure peach, then they found, like, the holy grail of peach <laughs> trees. Say artificial sweeteners. That's all it uh, says. Like so they, they took out the energy blend, the caffeine, the, <laughs> the sugar, and they gave they hit us with artificial stuff to sweeten it. Yeah. Okay, cool. But this Honestly, will yeah. still kill you. This will still kill <laughs> you like, <laughs> like the regular energy drink. It's gonna wreck your stomach. Look, uh, you, you you don't taste the alcohol. No, you don't. No, you don't at all. No. I mean, all I'm tasting really is this is a sweet peach. peach. Yeah. Yeah. No, like, I'm thinking like with... if I took like one, like a peach gummy ring and it, it was drinking that. Like, that's. You all right, Dom? I'm making sure there's no energy in it. Okay. <laughs> Does it really hit you that fast normally? No. Okay. <laughs> no, yeah. I mean, that's why I'm checking. Mm. Okay. Yeah. It's not a real energy drink. Look, <laughs> I'm not going to sit here and drink this whole 16, 18 ounce yeah. can. Yeah, this is a behemoth. <laughs> Pause. Um, but I will say, it definitely has me interested in trying the other flavors that they've come out with. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not sure of the whole lineup of flavors, but this this one was a this was a damn good start. What was the um, other ones like citrus and or regular base one? It's a mean green, mean and green, a white haze. Yeah. Okay. So that'll be their citrus and their base. So if you're, I wanted to be that one because I, I drink all I drink the green monster every day. But seeing right. as they took the stuff out, it probably won't taste like. It won't taste like that. If you're in the Pittsburgh area on Friday, October 27th, the Bertha and Bride of Kills is going to have a free sampling of all of them. So it'll be from 5 to 7 p.m. that night. Check it out. You know, if, if you're if you don't want to buy it and you're interested in trying it, you know, what's better than a free, yeah, and, free sampling of um, it? 
come and stop in because you may see your boys live uh, in living color up there, supporting the supporting the brew through and the and the launch, so to speak, um, sampling of these monster energy drinks there, or monster alcoholic drinks, I should say. Hey, look, for it being monster and and what we got, I'm gonna go three and a half on this. It's a little sweet, but like my teeth hurt right now. I feel like I got diabetes. Is it chatter? <laughs> yeah, I feel like I got diabetes. My sugar is definitely way too high, even though there's no alleged sugar in this. But if it if it was just a little a little less on the sweetness, I think I would have given it a higher ranking. But I, I'll go three. I'll go three and a half for sure. I like this a lot. Um, just like Jason said, it tastes like their low cal stuff. So my body's used to it. I give it a four out of six. I like this a lot better than I was expecting it to. Like, I really, whenever I heard that they even, whenever I saw them, I sent you guys the message, like, we're not doing this. <laughs> yeah, I, I did not I did not want to do it. But I'm actually surprised, so I'm going to go three on it. Yeah, I'm going to go four. Um, I don't know if I can drink just because of, the, like, the sweetness of the peach. I don't think if I, I can drink, like, these back-to-back. Yeah. Yeah, you have to break it up. Yeah, yeah. breaking it up, four. Donald, was this on Untapped? Yes, Untapped has it as a 3.62 out of a 5. Right on brand with um, yeah. Untapped. Um, yeah, definitely check this out. Head on over to the Brew Through Pittsburgh, October 27th. Get yourself a free sampling of this. All three. So they have all three flavors. Yeah. All three. Like I said, uh, come. We, we may be making a guest appearance to show up live and in a living color. Um, at least some of us um, will be there for sure. So. Head on over there, stop by, say hi, get some samples. Um, you know, we might do some recordings, some live, live in-person reactions, and um, you know, go from there. So with that being said, may your glass never be empty. Cheers. <laughs>